Welcome, my name is Kahe Hunjaki and you're listening to the African Tour Tales podcast on the Edify Podcast Network. Welcome to the African Tour Tales segment on Bloom Radio, the best of you. This is Kahe Hunjaki. Today's tale takes us to the beautiful island of the Seychelles. We'll be looking at the Cathedral of Our Lady of Immaculate Conception, also known as Cathedral of Victoria. It is among the first churches to be built and is the largest Catholic church in this African archipelago country of the Seychelles. It was established in 1892 by Pope Leo XIII. However, it was built in 1874 and is currently the seat of the Bishop of the Diocese of the Port of Victoria. The church is a sight to behold and one of the tourists' favorite spots because of its French architectural style. The Cathedral of Victoria is painted white and has a regal stone staircase at the entrance and two white pillars standing beautifully on either side of the cathedral's door which has stained glass windows. There are colored stone flags along the aisle of the church and it is the resting place of the first bishop of the Seychelles. The old structure was repaired in the 1990s, but the exterior was not touched. The church has a beautifully manicured garden that can host faithfuls in hundreds, a bell tower at the back, and La Domas, a two-story building overlooking the garden. La Domas houses the priests and has a majestic granite exterior which complements the garden. The Seychelles people and tourists flock the cathedral for prayers and also for the view, peace and tranquility that its surrounding exudes. The next time you visit Mahe Island in Seychelles, don't just marvel at the clock tower in the town of Victoria. The Cathedral of Our Lady of Immaculate Conception awaits. For more great podcasts that will build your faith, and inspire you, head over to edify.up and search for the Edify app in the Apple and Google Play stores.